What up, Charleston White? It's your boy, Mo Hustle. This is, uh, you know, I had to address a few things that you were speaking on in one of your videos. A lot of people brought it to my attention. And uh, so I, I just want to start off with, uh, you know, I know that you said um, you don't fuck with male Mexicans, but maybe it's um, because of your, your uh, baby mama's parents or family uh, mistreating you or whatever. But, you know, maybe they just don't like you. Maybe they don't like your personality. Maybe they think, uh, you know, you, you're a loud ass, loud mouth motherfucker. So it's like maybe that's the real problem, you know? I'm thinking um, they just don't like your personality. It's not because of your skin color or your race. Uh, sometimes people can be very annoying. Like me, my daughter, she can date any race that she wants. I don't care. I, I don't have a problem with it. But, uh, you know, it all depends on the personality of who she's dating. You know, so, uh, of course, if my daughter's dating a fucking retard, I'm, I'm not going to like the motherfucker no matter what color the motherfucker is. So let's get, let's, let's touch a little bit on that. Mexicans from Cali, I know you, you mentioned the Mexicans from Cali, you know, they ride with white folks against blacks and all that kind of stuff. And, you know, I, I, I understand uh, because I never knew the culture was like that until I went to Cali. But yeah, you know, and, and I'm not speaking for the whole Cali, but in some parts, yeah, the Mexicans and the blacks, uh, they don't agree with each other and they, they, they shoot each other and all kinds of crazy shit. But we're different down south. We don't do all that shit. We don't uh, uh, kill people because of the skin color. Uh, we're not racist like that. Like we're raised around blacks. We fuck with blacks. I got my black family is bigger than my Mexican family. It's crazy as hell. So, you know, I struggle with a lot of black folks, went on the road with a lot of black folks, you know, and, uh, that's just what it is. Like, we just don't have problems with other races here in Houston like that. You know what I mean? So when you speak on Mexicans and why you don't like Mexican males, like speak on the fact that the whole family probably just don't like you. And and I think you just said males because you want to be capping about, you know, yeah, I'll fuck the Mexican bitches and I'll do this and I'll do that. Okay, man, you clowning, bro. You, you, you're just trying to uh, reach for people's... Uh, uh, fucking feelings and, you know, all that. You're trying to get shit stirred up. But, you know, me personally, I fuck all women, you know? I fuck white women, I fuck black women, I fuck Mexican women, I fuck them all. If they sexy as fuck to me, if they got that sexy shit that going on for them, you know, and it, you know, and I want to smash or they just turn me on, then that's what I go for. I, I'm not out here being a racist. I, I fuck Asian. I fuck a Filipina or whatever. But, I'm not going to sit here and say, you know, I don't fuck with black men, but I fuck with black women. You know what I'm saying? Like, come on, bro. Like, let's be real. So I'm just addressing the shit that you were talking about. And another thing, man, I really didn't like the fact that uh, you want to speak on the innocent kids that got killed. You, you try to act like you're this positive uh, role model and all this stuff, uh, all these videos that I keep seeing that. You know, you're, you're, on here, you're out here uh, stirring up negativity, talking loud, doing all your shit, and you try to say that you're doing positive shit for the community. But, uh, you know, uh, putting out false narratives out there in the world that, you know, Mexicans are against blacks all the time and all this and that. Yeah, that shit might happen in Cali, but we don't even approve of that shit down south. So let's get those facts clear and understood. Uh, you know, uh, I didn't like the whole thing about Uvalde, bro. You going and saying uh, that fuck those Mexican kids that died and all that kind of shit, bro, that's, that's fucking some crazy shit. That's like if I would say someone in your race and I would, you know, clown on that, you know, if the kids, you know, passed away and it was black. You know what I mean? It's not right. It's not right. It's not right. So you got, you got to eat those words, bro, at the end of the day. Like, uh, don't be out here, you know, talk about innocent lives that got killed. Um, you just got an agenda on Mexicans. That's the craziest shit to me. Because uh, there's a lot of good Mexicans out here. And, you know, I ain't never been around no racist Mexican down south. Maybe out in Cali, bro, but not out here. But at the end of the day, 
I feel like you a bitch for half the shit you say anyway. You be out here online talking shit to, to all these people, uh, just stirring people up to get some attention. So Charleston White, you go fuck yourself in your ass and Mo Hustle said that, you know what I'm saying? Straight out of H-Town. And I, I'll, I'll be coming to Fort Worth too, it's all good. But we can chop it up, we go online, we can do whatever, I don't give a fuck. But uh, I am gonna speak my mind and, and uh, address the shit you said about Mexicans, you know? We fuck with blacks. Actually, you know, it's crazy as hell. Um, there's a lot of Mexicans that are black that, that don't know a lick of English. Uh, there's, there's Mexicans and Latinos of every shade of color from white all the way to dark, the darkest black you can find, you know? So let's uh, retract on that bullshit you said and maybe that your girl's family just don't like your ugly ass. That's what it is. So Charleston, I'm out this bitch, suck a dick twice a day.